can we get back to the thermostat for a minute? I'm astonished that you would waste that kind of energy. Are you insane? It's if it's 95 degrees outside and the nighttime low is 86, which it was last night. 78 is cool. You know what? I need a mansplainer to write us an email, an HVAC guy, because I want to know. And this this is a question I've always had. If, in fact, we do like Joe does, we set it at 78 when we're gone. And then when we get home, end of the day, we put it down to 70. Do you use more energy cooling the house from 78 down to 70 than you would if, if you, you just, just kept it. it at 70? Which is more cost effective and good for the environment? I got it at 78 when I'm home. That's not livable, Joe. I, I, we're completely just dis- God. It is no. no we're discounting it's you. Not. That's not it's livable. Not. You have not. You're not now, nor you ha- have you ever been a normal human being. You are. That's undeniable. You are. Uh, you're, okay. He's different. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Well, he's here's different. the other problem. If you have more than I have four levels at my house, so the upstairs is always very warm. Even yeah. if the air's on seventy, which it is right now, right. and right. down here where I'm sitting right now, sixty two meat. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah it's, nice. It, yeah. If I were upstairs at 78, it'd be 85 in my upstairs. It'd be horrible. Oh, I'd be sweating. so angry. It's a dry 78. You walk in from <laughs> outside, it feels wonderful. No. What's wrong unless, with you, morons? I would go get a hotel room. <laughs> yes. Exactly. Seriously, I could not live in 78 degrees. And I think that would I'm be okay. the majority of, of yeah. Americans. Yeah. 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 You can't live like that. Uh, just uh, accept the fact that you're a little bit different, my friend. A little different. In fact, Joe, yeah. in, the, in the dead of winter, she'll usually set the thermostat at 70. Yeah. I will just shut the heat off when we go to bed. Oh, in the winter, I got it at 73. 73 or 4. Hmm. Okay. Wow. Uh, That's okay. a little warm. But so, I'm, I mean, I'm not a... stating my case correctly. I'm not stating it correctly because... There, there's a tremendous disconnect between what the thermostat is set at and what you guys think the house feels like. I know what the house feels it like. It feels wonderful. N- no, oh. Joe, it doesn't. All right, here we go. New topic. Instead yeah. of uh, alerting us about all the American legions in the state of Minnesota, what do you set your thermostat at? <laughs> Call yeah. us now. I Call don't want to hear from anybody. <laughs> Call, now. Call me now. G L Joe at GarageLogic.com. <laughs> yeah, I got her at seventy-one, Such. By the way, can I get the time in the temp? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Hey, how are you? There's, uh, if I could, I'm not uh, doing it, by the way, to be conscientious or no you like the yeah. heat it, no does, it's you're not hot you're what does the cp say about she's that? probably the reason it's at 78 she's but it works cold normally huh yeah she's cold normally. Yeah. What, and yeah. the kids you used to have don't they they're there every day yeah they yeah what about them they don't mind 78 huh not when you come out oh, coming in from outside where it's 95 right it right? just sounds like a sauna to me. I'm sorry. God, I wouldn't you, last five minutes. Seriously. You guys I, are complete fruitcakes. I'd be at a hotel. You do the Grandpa Simpson, the meme, where he walks in, tips his cap, and then just walks right back outside of the restaurant. You That'd probably don't even house. need to worry about this at Giants Ridge.